Indians and India, thanks to many members of the diaspora, know America and Americans so much better than vice versa. Everybody, whether it's business, higher education, government, in America now wants to know India. India is the center of the universe. Indians and India, thanks to many members of the diaspora, know America and Americans so much better than vice versa. I'm just being honest. Most Americans know a little bit of northern Indian cooking, have an idea of some tech stuff here, know that there's some issues with maybe common strategic threats we face. But other than that, can't really string a paragraph together about India unless they visited here. More American students at the university level studied in Costa Rica than in India in recent years, which says a lot about Costa Rica. We all would love to study if we were 20 years old in Costa Rica, but we need a generation of Indianists who know the languages, the cultures, the traditions. And India has to prepare itself for America because Americans coming here want very different things than Indians coming to America. Indians from uh, India are coming to America to study STEM, to invest in finance. Americans are interested in health and wellness and history and other things that can bring together our nations. Our higher education is ready to come together in a way that we simply couldn't partially because of rules here in India and partially because of hesitance in America. But everybody, whether it's business, higher education, government, in America now wants to know India. India is the center of the universe and the India-American relationship, as I said, is not only a force for good, but a force for ch positive change in a world that badly needs it.